My name is Annika Halverson. I am a senior this year. I do cross country and track, so year-round running, and I am majoring, double majoring in sociology and reconciliation. I was a little bit of a procrastinator at the college search, and so um, I found um, Bethel kind of late in the fall, my senior year, and I had some family members that went here, and so when I was like, I think when I was five, um, I slept over in the guy's dorm because my uncle went here. I slept in the closet, so. <laughs> So I had I had a pre-visit a long time ago and I felt comfortable here. Um, I prayed a lot about it and I really felt like this is where God was leading me. Um, I really felt that strong pull to Bethel um, as opposed to the U and a couple of the D1 schools that were recruiting me. So I decided that I wasn't going to go the D1 route and I got a lot of criticism for that, but I knew this is where God wanted me to be. And the big tipper was when Coach Rock um, sent me a letter and it was um, just a picture that he drew <laughs> in the mail and it was of my family cheering for me and it said keep that cheering section close by and I was like all right well this is the most creative recruitment that I've ever received so I have to go with it. Nationals my sophomore year for cross country was really special and not necessarily because of my performance but because um, there were, I think there were only two athletes that that made it it was me and, and Matt Barron's that year and so um, the there's so many members of my team came out and they, they made t-shirts um, for us and they were there the whole way supporting and cheering and it meant so much to have, to just be surrounded by these incredible people that I get to be teammates with and, um, and when we found out that I did make All-American, they were more excited than I was and I felt so honored and so loved and it was just an incredible experience, I think, mostly because of um, my relationship with my team. Unity, we've really been emphasizing that. Um, I really think that's an important aspect to any team and I think that that's really emphasized at Bethel. Um, and that at least all the teams that I've seen, I room, I room with some soccer girls, so <laughs> I see a little piece of their team culture too. And our cross country team, like, you have to be united to make it through those workouts and through those races, because like yesterday was not so fun doing 600s around the football field, but <laughs> But I had my whole team with me. I would not have been able to do that on my own. He'd probably joke around a little bit with me and um, give me a little bit crap because that's like, <laughs> that's kind of the culture of our team. Um, he says similar, like similar, so we all kind of make fun of him for that. <laughs> I think that this is a similar thing to blah, blah, blah. <laughs> that's very Stevens, so he's great. <laughs> I want to leave behind a culture of people who want to be transformed in their faith. You know, I think that it's really easy um, to go through the motions and to um, kind of just live life how everyone else is living life. And I think that there's really unique opportunities everywhere at every college and um, to continually uh, be transformed in your faith. So I would love to leave, um, leave that culture behind.